Okay, so the memory is from Corsair. This, these are the, called the Vengeance. And there's two, it says eight gigs, but there's two four gigabyte cards in here. And the reason why I got them um, is to match my old, I already have eight gigabytes of the same thing. But, I mean, I bought them for a reason, right? Because I think they're the best. So, these run at 1,866 megahertz. A lot of them that you find out there run at 1,600 megahertz. Of course, I'm trying to get speed. So, I bought these because they're they're great memory. I've never had any problems with them, and uh, they run a little faster than normal. All right, and this is the 600B uh, power supply by EVGA. Now the reason why I chose this uh, power supply is because uh, it had a lot of great reviews, it was a really good price, it was like $65, something like that. And um, I, I like that a lot of gamers actually reviewed this, so good choice. And so here on the cooling system, I decided to go with the Cooler Master Hyper 212 Evo because it had a lot of great reviews. And there's a there's a lot of different brands and a lot of different coolers, but this one in particular had really great reviews and for the price of $27 was more than economical. And so this uh, Asus uh, video card is the GeForce GTX 1060. And what I wanna show you here is, this is the overclock edition, which means that we'll get faster speeds. Six gigabytes is a lot more than you need for a video card. Um, of course, you can buy some other ones that for the same price or different brands, but you know, you'll get like two gigs or four gigs for the RX 480 or the 970. But this one, the 1060, when the other gamers reviewed it, showed that it had like same clocking speed as some of the best cards out there that cost like $600, $800. And so for the price under 300 bucks, you can't beat it. That's why I chose this one. If you want to see more details on any of these products, um, click here or here or there or 